12th Man TV is back in the film room for the final time this spring. As always, our coverage has been brought to you by your local Texas Ford dealers. And we are joined by quarterbacks coach and offensive coordinator Cliff Kingsbury. A bit from now, he will take you through a little bit of a session, but we question him first here. And uh, you went into this spring with a competition on your hands, and I think that's been well documented. A lot of people know about it. Coach Sumlin mentioned before you guys started, maybe it doesn't have to get decided this spring. Do you anticipate heading out of spring and maybe not having the depth chart fully filled out? Yeah, we're still working through it. You know, it's, it's one thing you want to take your time with. You want to make sure you're making the right decisions. So we, we've seen a lot of progress thus far, and, and we'll, we'll see how the spring ends up. All right. Well, kind of take us through what you've been working with these guys. I know they're going through a transition, like a lot of guys, and I think you've said footwork is key to what they're doing right now. Why don't you take us to the film and show us a little All bit right. about it? Yeah, they've been, you know, under center a lot more than, than they have this spring. We're, we're more of a shotgun-based offense, so we're predominantly in the shotgun. So we've been working better footwork in our drops. We kind of have a three-step drop and then a quick game drop. That right there, if you're running back, was the uh, three-step drop. And Jamil does a good job here. He's one, two, three, gets it up pretty well on time. One thing, you'd like to see him keep two hands on the ball and not pat it. So that's something we've been working with him on. Uh, this, this next one here is of Johnny. Um, Johnny's got some gunslinger in him. So you'll see here the, the read breaks down. We like him. We've been working this in. We like them to go ahead and scramble at this point. All right, he gets through his reads. One, two, three. Nothing's open instead of just stopping his feet. All right, let's go ahead and get out of the pocket, make the receivers uncover for you, and, and make a throw downfield. And then we got Matt. You know, he's the biggest guy. A lot of times he'll hitch up. He's so tall, he hitches way up. You know, and that'll get him into the line. He doesn't realize he's doing it. He's such a big guy. So we've been really trying to work with him on staying in one spot and not running him in, himself into the D line like that. One thing he does a great job, if you're running back a little bit, is getting through his throws. You see how he follows through and gets through his throw? It's really good getting everything he has into that throw and getting a lot on the ball. So just, just a transition period for them being in the shotgun, you know, predominantly more than they were uh, in the last offense. And they've done a good job picking up our footwork and what we're trying to get done. All right, we'll bring you back over. And that's your film session right there. But offensive coordinator, also your role there. All 11 of them, the two deep, how are they picking up this new system? I think good. I think, uh, you know, from day one, we turned on the day one film the other day to see what we felt as an offensive staff and it's it's light years from where they were which is encouraging so we felt like we've gotten better every week and, and that's been our goal in the spring so I want to finish it strong this this Saturday and uh, carry it on to the summer workouts yeah and the, the Saturday that spring game when you meet with these quarterbacks throughout the week will you pinpoint things you want to see from each of them as they will be in front of a crowd on Saturday a little bit of pressure in those maroon and white games isn't there yeah, I guess so. I think uh, this whole spring's been pressure, every practice with the situation they've been in. So you, you throw the fans out there, and um, you like to see who's going to show up when the lights come on. All right. Appreciate you spending the time with us. Good luck in the Maroon and White game Thank on you. Saturday. Thank you. Appreciate you having me. That's Cliff Kingsbury, 12th Man TV, for the final time this spring in the film room. <laughs>